stop casting. Chase the dream. Welcome to Season 6 of Musky Mastery Outdoors. Brought to you by Joe Booker Outdoors. Number one in big game fish products. And by Recon Boats. Made by craftsmen. Built for fishermen. Look at the size of that one. Figure eight, 500 Booker Tail Tinsel Goldilocks getting the job done. Wow, she came in and just clobbered it. We'll get her back and I'll fill you guys in on all the details. things here as we as we uh, you know you know think about the learning moments that went into this uh, this segment so far first of all is just staying persistent you're getting probably sick of hearing me say that but this season more so than ever before it's a persistence pays off type of thing these muskies are not eating you know under under what I would call very opportune conditions all the time I've been I have been uh, you know on some great spots this season under some prime conditions and seen actually nothing not even side imaging follows and my mentality is okay well I know there's muskies there I've just got to stick on them and so you get up the next day and you get up early you might only have four and a half five hours of sleep in the tank once you're off the water from night fishing or whatever but you just got to get back on them because these fish are gonna go they're not going they're not eating, when I say going, I mean eating. They're not necessarily eating this season at what I would call their you know, typical eating times. Although this morning we do have a moonrise thing. But I'm just saying that because last night I was very surprised that with this, this uh, storm approaching, I didn't have more activity. But again, I stayed on them here and we got them going. A couple things there on the figure eight fight. You saw I kind of worked that fish around the boat. I couldn't tell how she was hooked initially, so I tried to just keep that momentum and keep her moving in a direction. As I kept a tight line, I kept my rod down, I kept it buried as she came up and just bulldogged with her big head and uh, worked her around the boat until I could see how she was hooked. Thankfully, she was hooked well and I was able to put the bag on her. But uh, that's kind of the story here today, guys. I'm gonna, uh, I'm gonna try to take advantage of this cloud cover. We've got this beautiful cloud cover still hanging around as this frontal system moves through. Interestingly, both these muskies I caught hit when, or just before, but really when that wind was still blowing out of the south, southwest, right when it switched out of the north. I don't know, I haven't seen anything yet, but uh, we will see what happens. So anyway, with that said, guys, I really hope you've enjoyed this muskie segment. I've really enjoyed putting this one together. It's it's just been uh, it's it's always a uh, it's always a challenge, but uh, I absolutely love the process. I love the hunt. So, really hope you enjoyed this one. So, as always, thanks for watching.